welcome to Best Choice Trailers and RV Center located in beautiful Irwin, Pennsylvania, 724-864-1449. Today we've got a 2021 Flagstaff E-Pro 19FDS. It's a single axle premium camper. It features off-road package. This camper has an automotive style glass windshield in the front. It has lights. 20 pound LP tanks, does feature a power front tongue jack, as well as a dual battery center. A lot of storage in this 19 foot. We've got storage here, located behind the door, and down the side in the rear. This camper also features a touchless uh, keypad, for entry, in case you leave your keys, it features the more ride steady steps, large grab handle, and it has power awning with LED lights. This camper weighs 3,373 pounds with the current equipment on it, so it's ultra light, towable by about anything. Notice the oversized tires with aluminum wheels, keeps the body up off the ground as well as clearance when you go to off-roading. This camper also features a Dexter axle, which is an independent style axle. It's not a leaf spring type axle. On the exterior, you have a table that's a collapsible metal table, as well as a griddle that would sit here that is a uh, propane-driven griddle that has a quick connect under the body that's connected to the propane system. The hot water tank is a six gallon quick recovery, direct spark ignition, gas and electric. And as you can see, we have the rear storage area as well. This camper features all LED lights, fronts, sides, and the back. The port station located here has everything for your uh, city water connection, black tank flush, a quick antifreeze inlet for very fast winterization, and cable and satellite outlet. Standard on all E-Pros is a ladder to the roof and an outside shower with hot and cold running water and a five foot hose. You can get the optional backup camera. And if you look above that, you notice it comes factory standard with the max air covers over the rear vent. It is a 30 amp camper. This is on the non-door side. You have all your exit points in the rear as well as a nice slide out for more space inside. Frameless tint glass windows. More storage forward. And this camper also has an enclosed heated underbelly with additional heat blankets on the tanks for going further into the wintertime and bring out earlier in the spring. So let's go back around to the inside of the camp. Some of the versatile features in the front is that we have the couch, which also makes two Lazy Boy style chairs. It has what I, my wife and I call the fight separator with cup holders. And this is used for entertaining during the daytime or just relaxing. But the nice thing is you just pull this handle up and down and you pull this and this bed is cantilevered with shocks and comes down into a bed lock position this is a full-size queen bed 60 by 80 it is a gel top memory foam sofa very comfortable each side of the couch has 110 outlets as well as a USB port for charging your phones very easy to operate Couch goes up, a lot of storage underneath. Storage on either side of the bed. Fairly deep cabinetry. Going into the galley area, we have the uh, Magic Chef refrigerator. For a small unit, it's a large refrigerator. A lot of capacity. Most campers like this have a single door refrigerator that's half the size. 
We have an exterior vent fan that does uh, uh, vent to the exterior, as well as a three-top burner by Suburban. Normally, again, you would see a two-top. This is a three-top with glass cover. <clears throat> it has the half-time oven, which does baking as well as microwaving and broiling. The large stainless steel sink has a drain pad with it, and it has a single lever faucet. An interesting thing, just because there is a minimal room, but they try to maximize it for you, is you do have a USB charge port, as well as a dual 110 press button operated outlet in the back of the sink area. Decent amount of storage. Going to the dinette side, the dinette does fold down into a short bed. Some of the features that this camper has is it offers a TST tire monitoring system, which is a wireless device to monitor your tire pressure. Any emergencies you may have, it does come with the camper. And it's equipped already with a 100 watt solar panel on the roof, and it does have an inverter system, which allows you to use 110 for up to six hours on a full charge of dual batteries. So again, going off grid, this does have a lot of things people want to offer that extended stay out in the wilderness. It does come with an RV Technologies radio, which is AM, FM, with inside and outside sound. It does sync with Bluetooth, and it does have an HDMI port as well as a USB port. The Wi-Fi Ranger option basically is an amplifier that's on the roof that would draw in any free Wi-Fi signal that you would be offered at a campground and basically boost what you're having coming in so you don't have slow uploads. The television is a 12 volt TV with CD on the side for DVD and CD play. So again, this can be used on a 12 volt system, does not need 110. In this camper, the only items that do need 110 are going to be the air conditioner and the microwave. So the air conditioner, by the way, is a 13.5 roof mount uh, air conditioner. Going back to the bath area, we have a large foot flush toilet, which is a ceramic base bowl, a large step in shower. I'm six foot one and have plenty of room, and a very nice closable shower curtain. It features a stainless steel sink, hot and cold running water, as well as a fantastic vent fan in the roof. So folks, come on out to Best Choice Trailers and RVs in Irwin, Pennsylvania and give us a look. Thank you.